One summer I set off alone on an attempt to cross a thousand miles of the most remote wilderness in America, the Brooks Range of northern Alaska. It was a journey of mountains and solitude, river crossings and rapids, mountain passes and gravel bars, wolves and grizzlies and caribou. This video shows some of the wolf encounters I had, including this unusually colored wolf I saw in the Arctic National Wildlife Refuge. Luckily I spotted this wolf before he spotted me and I quickly laid down. That's why he got so close, he just didn't know what I was. I can hear the family. And there's his brother. Brother's much smarter, or sister, because he stayed in the brush almost the whole time. Looked a quarter mile away across the canyon here. There's another wolf watching me. That one looks white, doesn't it? I'm guessing this is the track of the big male I saw yesterday. What I believe to be the big male, the white one across. If you're a moose, you don't want a pack of these guys after you. There's a wolf sleeping right there. That's an adult white timber wolf. Sleeping flat. Then a stone's through. I think this is just an old lone wolf trying to nap in the evening sun. He's headed off down the valley now. He's coming towards me little ways to, to get to the easier walking.
Well, that was a remarkable experience. I uh, sneaked up as close to him as I dared, and he was laying flat, head down, sleeping soundly. He was sleeping so soundly, like a dog, he almost couldn't wake up. Really unusual, really interesting. Well, that was a rare, amazing thing to see. It's a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity, even in Alaska. I'm working on a DVD about my trip across northern Alaska, and I hope you'll visit my website to read some stories about my trip and to see a lot more photos.